All right, so this is a pre-calculus week three delta math assignment. Uh, we're doing graphing piecewise function. This one is a level three problem. So we're going to graph the following function, um, and we're going to have three parts to this piecewise. So when x is less than or equal to negative three, we're going to graph this line. When x is between negative three and positive one, we're going to graph this line. And when x is greater than or equal to 1, we're going to graph this line. Okay, so we're going to have three different lines at three different parts. All right, so let's start with the first one, which is coming from less than negative 3. So think of it as coming from negative infinity up to negative 3. Up to this point, um, we have this line uh, negative 5 thirds x minus 6. So let's plug a negative 3 in there. If we plug a negative 3 in here for x, the negative times a negative gets us a positive, and the 3's cancel, leaving us with just the 5. So 5 minus 6 is negative 1. So at negative 3, we have a point at negative 1. Okay, there it is. And the slope is negative 5 thirds. So normally, you would go down 5 over 3. But since we want to come from negative infinity, we're going to go up 3, up, sorry, up 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and backwards 3, 1, 2, 3. All right, then we're going to hit this point until it becomes an arrow, signifying the ray coming from that direction. And this point right here, we need to check if it's opened or closed. It has the equal part, so it should remain closed. All right, that part's done. Now let's do the second part of the piecewise. So the second part of the piecewise goes from negative 3 to positive 1. So it's what's happening between here and here. This one is also a line, and it's the line y equals x plus 2. It should cross the y-axis at positive 2, have a slope of 1 over 1, go like this, okay? But we, needed, we need it to start at negative 3. So if we plug a negative 3 in here, negative 3 plus 2 is negative 1. So at negative 3, we have a point. It's a shared point right here. So we're going to leave it closed, even though this indicates that it should be open. But because it's sharing with a point that's already closed, we'll just leave it closed. And then the slope is 1 over 1. So I'm going to go up 1 over 1, up 1 over 1. Oh, I should keep going until I get to 1. So up 1 over 1, up 1 over 1. OK. All right. Now let's do the last or the third part of the piecewise. And it's everything from 1 greater all the way to positive infinity going this direction. And it's x or y equals x. So whatever number you plug in, you're going to get the same number out. So it would be the point 1, 1, 2, 2, 3, 3, 4, 4, 5, 5, and so on. So at, um, at 1, it should be 1, 1. And then going up 1 over 1, up 1 over 1 keeps going this way. So I'm going to make this into a ray going that way. And let's see, that should has the equal part, so that point should be filled in. Did I mess up this one? Let me check. So at 1, it sh doesn't have the equal part, so I need an open circle right there. Okay? All right, fix that up, and let's check it. All right, it likes it. 